Welcome back to another episode of Vanilla Swirl, guys. My name is FlukeWalker42. Um, I'm just going to bring it back in real quick. I've been out running around doing a little bit more exploring before I start the next episode officially, but I just thought that I would show you that I did just indeed find another teleporter. Uh, so it looks like northeast teleporter here. Um, so that's kind of cool. I'm just going to go through here uh, just to make sure that it's fully discovered and then pop back through and I will bring you guys back when I actually find something else interesting to show you. So see you in a minute. Well guys, I said I would bring you back when I had something interesting to show you. Um, so if you remember last time, the book that told us where we wanted to go next said it was high elevation with a low uh, bedrock ceiling. I think I found it. But I'm not ready to go up there yet, guys. So I'm going to actually avoid it, but I am looking at my map. Um, I do see where that is, um, so when I'm ready for it, we will come back for it, uh, but until then, uh, we're going to run away, bravely, bravely run away. Um, so just to let you guys know what I am doing, um, I have an idea to help get a little bit, a little bit better equipped. Um, I have an idea on how to... Um, maybe clear another one of those uh, ugh, this is, cliff is no fun uh, how to clear another one of those uh, last dungeons with all the webs a little bit easier um, if you remember uh, what's that over there I'm going to run over there I think and see um, if you remember one of the loot items that came in one of those treasure chests was a potion that turned at daylight for five minutes. Well, my theory is that if I can find another one of those web dungeons, um, where's the skeleton? I don't know. If I can find another one of those web dungeons um, and drink the daylight potion, then it should be relatively easy to clear and then I can get, hopefully, some more diamonds, um, and maybe some other good loot, and maybe be a little better off for our next uh, big dungeon, which is really the last big dungeon, I believe, in this um, CTM. So that's kind of my plan, guys. If I find another one, uh, I will certainly bring you in to show you if it works or not or if I'm going to, you know, die miserably. But either way, um, I will bring you guys back in next time I find something interesting, which I kind of just did. I guess I will show you what... Um, actually, there's two... Ra oh, no, that's that. Yeah, that's that. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's definitely what I want there. So uh, let's quickly look in here. Definitely want to take that slime block. I don't think I would need that, but, you know, whatever. Glowstone. I'm kind of getting to the point where I don't need a lot of this stuff. Um, now, what's in this? Aha, got up here. Uh, Ender Pearl, okay, that's interesting. Smite, honestly, I think I'm going to leave the smite there. Um, I'll take the oak wood instead. Obsidian? Eh, that could be useful. Um, anything? Hmm, what else can I get rid of here? Eh, don't really... Actually, you know what? Let's get rid of that. And let's actually grab a full stack of wood. There we go. That should be good, like that. Um, and anyway, so I will bring you guys back if I see anything else interesting. Um, but until then, 
Oops. Uh, see in just a minute. And welcome back, guys. Um, so I did just find what I was looking for. I did find another one of those uh, web dungeons. Uh, but it was nearby the southeast um, uh, southeast beacon, or uh, southeast quick travel. Uh, so I just ran back to unload my inventory a bit before we head out there. Uh, also, I wanted to show you uh, that northeast guy um, had a speed potion, so I now have speed, strength, and haste permanently. Also... I noticed, I think it was the pumpkin that gave us the orange stained glass, but I apparently didn't have any of those. I thought we had already got one, but apparently not. So there's that one. We are now to 7 of 16 of the bonus monument. We're moving right along. Um, my armor's pretty crappy right now, but I'm hoping that with the daylight potion... Um... Hopefully with the Daylight Potion, this uh, will not be too hard. Um, so I think I'm just going to go ahead and go to the southeast, like so. Um, and then I'm going to re-log real quick just to make sure that everything's working properly. And then I'll be back with you guys when I am back to the... Um... <gasps> One of my puppies! Two of my puppies. Oh my goodness. Anyway, um, <laughs> I'll be back with you guys when I am back to the web dungeon, and we can try this little theory of mine out. All right, welcome back, guys. As you can see, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. I just did something very naughty. Where's he at? Okay. Whew. Okay, that was exciting. Not at all what I intended to do. Um, anyway, uh, as you can see, we're back at the web um, thing, uh, web dungeon. Um, and I'm going to try drinking this potion and see if... Uh, oh, I didn't even see that. Okay. So this is not going to work nearly as well as I had hoped. Um, that is unfortunate. Okay, so yeah, not, not really going to work like I had hoped. Um, ouch. Okay. Okay. So not really, not really gonna work the way I'd hope. So um, that's okay. And I really don't like this one because it's got Enderman all over in it. Uh, so I think perhaps. I'm just going to scrap that idea. It was a good idea, but I don't think it's going to work out. Um, so, however, while I have all this lovely daylight, um, I think I am going to attempt to run over to um, the other... Oops. Wow. Uh, over to the other quick travel, to the southwest. Um... So I will see you guys in just a minute when I find that or if I see anything else interesting along the way. So I'll be back with you in just a minute. So I am continuing my path over to the other shortcut, but on my way I came through this uh, spruce forest, I guess. Um, and there was a bunch of this uh, mossy stone, but look what I just found. I believe it's a new... Uh, new color of stained glass. 
um, to add to our collection. I may be, I don't know, two-thirds of the way, possibly, to the next shortcut. Um, ah, that was cheaty. Um, so hopefully, I will be able to... Ouch. Um... Come on. There we go. Um, so I should be there in just a minute, and once I get there, I will bring you guys back in. So see you in just a minute. So guys, I have just been running, and I see off in the distance what should be a shortcut. I do see another chest up there. I'm not sure I'm going to go get it right at the moment. Um, but I, something to consider for the future. Go ahead and let's go unlock this one. And, ooh, okay, that, is that a ravine? Looks like it might all... Ah, whatever. Anyway, um, okay, another two teleporter. Whee! And I will be back with you guys in just a second after I clear out my inventory and decide what we're going to do from here since my other plan didn't work. Alright, welcome back guys. I think I have figured out what I'm going to try to do. Let's see if it actually works out. Uh, so first off, I'm going to make diamond pants, I think. Okay. Um, and then with the diamond pants, I'm going to put protection and men... Ooh, that's really expensive. Okay. Um, well, let's, let's see, I don't know if I'm going to have enough to do that, um, but let's, let's do these other things first, because I'm pretty sure I'm going to have enough to do them, maybe? Oh, maybe not. <laughs> I should have calculated this better. Um, okay. What's highest priority here? Um, well, good lord. What do I have the experience for? I guess I have experience for the sword. Okay. Um, but, that being said, that'll be a very nice sword. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, didn't quite work out the way I wanted it to here. Uh, but that's okay. We'll figure it out. Um, so I'm not going to put those diamond pants on without enchanting them. So let's go ahead and throw those like that, and put the bow in there like that. Let's go ahead and grab out all these arrows that I just thought I wasn't going to need. Um, and I'm also need pretty much all this other armor here. Um, grab those, perhaps. Like so, and then need a helmet as well. Okay. Well, this is not what I intended to look like right now. I intended to have a lot of really kick-butt upgrades. Uh, I think I'm actually going to leave that axe here. I think with that sword that I have now, the axe is really kind of uh, just redundant. And that'll open up a inventory spot there. Throw those arrows there. Foo, no, throw blocks there. Like so. There we go. I'm pretty happy with that. So, oh yes, and also, let's go ahead and throw these white stained glass in, like so. And we are at halfway with the bonus monument, which is pretty cool. Um, okay, well, I guess... Um, hmm, that's unfortunate. I was really hoping to be better equipped than this. Oh well, such is life. Um, I guess I will see you guys in just a minute when I head uh, back over to that new place we need to defeat. So I'll see you then. 
real quick before I head out, I did just realize I do have another uh, boost to do. So the Enduring Health, Health Boost 2, plus 8 health, which would be very helpful. Uh, do that. Bottoms up. Okay, awesome. Go ahead and throw that in there. Alright, so now that that's done, <laughs> I really will see you guys in just a minute. Welcome back. I made one more side, uh, side stop, um, just because I feel like a bow is going to be really important. Um, so now that I have a nice sword, I also have a very nice bow. Power 5, Unbreaking 3, Punch 2, Infinity Bow. That should last, hopefully, the rest of the map if I don't die. And, uh, yeah, punch power five. Yes, please. So, uh, we still don't have the armor that we wanted. Um, however, that being said, uh, I did do, uh, some more, uh, or how I got the levels is I was actually, um, killing Enderman, uh, and turns out... Enderman drop some decent armor, uh, so I do have uh, projectile protection, iron chest plate. Uh, I think I am going to take that. Um, I think that'll be more important than the blast protection. I have fire protection and projectile protection here. Um, ooh, those golden boots are about to break. Do I have something else that I can wear? Feather Falling 3, Unbreaking 2. Protection 2, Protection 2. If I could combine, but I have no levels, of course. <laughs> That's okay. Um, I might actually see if I can do that. Um, yeah. Protection 2, okay. Those ones are going on there. Oh wait, there's a protection too, chest plate. Yes, please. Um, so we're going to put on that, I think. It's fire protection two and three with protection two. I'd like to have unbreaking on these two, but, you know, it is what it is. So I'm going to go ahead and put these in here like that and throw my spare arrows uh, I guess in here like so. Sorry, it's, it's, it's time for the kids to go to bed in my house. So like that and I think maybe I'm finally ready to go. Again. For the last time, hopefully. So let's go ahead and head on out. I believe it was northeast. I think that little patch to the far northeast, I think, is where I'm going. So um, I will probably read to my kids and then I will be back with you guys hopefully over in that area finally so until then be safe <laughs>